All right, what's going on, guys? Today we're back with some more Forza Horizon 3, and I'm going... Like, I was already heading there, but I paused it. I'm... Thank you. I'm on my way to the city to do a nice drift zone that I found last night, and I'm going to rip it, and hopefully I'm going to try to beat my old score and get a new top score. I think three stars at the thing is at 50,000, so... I don't know if that's a decent amount or not, but I'm going to try to beat it, whatever my record is, and, and then go drift around in the city. So, let's do this. Remember that Ferrari Dino we found? Well, you should see her now. Come on down. Oh, man. Alright, so... I was heading down there. And I'm going to turn around, go right back to um, one of the zones. So I'll go to this one and then stop the drift zone after. Because he just told me that my car was ready. My restoration car, the, the Dino or the Dino or whatever. I saw a lot of people comment. I know I pronounced it wrong and I probably but butchered it. And I'm sorry for that. But as someone said, I'm American and... I'm gonna mess up a lot of pronunciation, so we're gonna head go get that garage car and see how good it is. At the roundabout, take the second exit. Woo! And I like drifting in this. I like drifting in this game too. It's it's nice. It's a lot of sliding though, and you still have a decent amount of grip. I don't know, I don't know what it is. Like, I even have the smallest tires on here. Like, a decent amount of grip, but, like half throttle, because as soon as you go full, it's just all spin. But I've, I'm gonna try to like make a tune for this. I haven't made any tunes on Forza Horizon 3, but so actually I'll probably install one first and see how it works and like try to replicate it, but. I did a lot of the tuning stuff in Forza 6, but in this game, I'm not, right. not that great with it, so in bear with me yards. while I'm still drifting in fifth gear, because a lot of people don't like that. They said that you should have a tune that should be not, you know, fourth, fifth gear, and just completely mad and drifting. Should, I don't know, have a, a little bit more grip or something. And I keep crashing into every single person, but I'm just trying to get through this garage here. Arrived at your destination. Uh, let's see. How do we get to restoration cars? Um, there we go. Barn finds, not restoration cars. Ready to collect. Ready to see the stats in three, two, one. Not just a Dino. A 246 yes, GT Leo, I hear you. I will bring you out soon, okay? As smooth as it did the day it rolled off the production. He literally waits every time. It took a little while to get that smell out of the seats, though. That is a nice, like, classic-looking car. That's beautiful. Imagine owning this when it first came out. You probably felt like such a baller. Yeah, this is really nice. I'm just going to keep it how it is for right now, but maybe eventually I'll do a little something to it. But We got our first barn find. This is what it is. I know a lot of people already know, but for those of you who, are, uh, for those of you who don't, this is the first bar, barn find that you get. It's a really nice car. If I upgrade it, it's definitely going to be for like track purposes. I don't really want to drift it because it kind of looks a little too long, but... We'll head right back out, and then I'm going to head to that drift zone and see if we can beat my old score. Alright guys, so we are back. I just brought Leo out and, all, and uh, all that. He kept begging. He was getting really loud, so I brought him out. We're a mile away from this drift spot, so I am going to attempt to beat my score first try, but I don't remember this one, so I wouldn't be surprised if I went off the road. But I can see it on the map. Oh. See it? 
See, that's every time I look away, I can always crash into someone, no matter what, even if it's for half a second. The, um, the traffic in this game is relentless. All right, here we go. Try number one. Oh man, I have no idea how I got 50,000 on this one. Well, 30,000 for the warm up, which is. Oh, 54,000. I'm gonna try to beat Chris, actually. I'm gonna try to beat Chris's record. You just have to go back and forth on this one because this straight is way too long. Oh yeah! All right, we got it. Is it? Is I wonder if there's any other friends above me. There's gotta be in the top five percent. I get. All right. Well, I don't know if anyone else was really trying, but I have. The best drift score out of my friends, so that's one good thing. I'm gonna I'm gonna do this one more time actually. This spot is pretty fun, but you have to do it the other way. Oh, come on! Give me a break! I'm in a drift zone. Please move over. There's way too much traffic right now. This is ridiculous. Destination. What are you doing? Literally went on the other side of the road, like going completely straight, and then turned. Yep. If anyone knows if you can turn off traffic in this game somehow on single player mode only, please let me know because they get in my way so much and it's very aggravating. Oh, I don't think I'm gonna get 58,000 again, so I'm gonna look for another drift spot pretty close. Okay, guys, so we are at another drift zone. This one, I think the limit is like the score is only 25,000. It's only like two or three corners, so we're gonna go for this one too. And of course, the whole time I hit that, that car was my fault, but the whole time there was no traffic there, and then as soon as I pressed the record button, both cars have to pull in and block both ways to the road, of course. Ah! Uh, yeah, that was, that was really jump. I went right off. I need to get in place for that. You have arrived at your destination. Right. I'm only going to start off this way because it's all concrete, so... It keeps saying I'm in, like, the top 4%. A lot of people really don't have, must not have this game yet, because I should be, like, in the top 50%. There's no way. So we're going to go in. Not hit any cars this time. It looks really clear. That's nice. And get an amazing score. Oh, yeah. That was a beautiful Having no cars there literally makes a world of a difference. Like, it makes it so much easier for you. I'm just gonna circle around and hit it again. Oh man. I really wish I had a wheel. Ugh. Yeah, I spun out. I'm gonna I'm gonna end it right here. I hit two drift spots. Beat my personal scores on both of them, and I think I'm on the top of my friends' like leaderboards for both of them. So if you guys like this video, definitely leave the thumbs up and subscribe for more.